Pops. Hang on a minute. <laughs> I'm getting mixed up here now. You're a tight ass. That's all I've got. <laughs> <laughs> My speech is gone, I'm sorry. When we brought you home, we were so proud. All them years ago, a little bundle of joy into our home, and I never thought we'd be here so quick. It just seems like two minutes. We were so proud of you then, and we're so proud of you now, of the strong, positive, determined woman you have become, and I cannot imagine anyone better than your side than Adam. Uh, this ring I give to you. As a sign of the promises made. As a sign of the promises made. On this our wedding day. On this our wedding day. No, but seriously, I think we can all agree that Sammy looks absolutely unreal today. I'm such a lucky man. You're kind, caring and selfless. I absolutely adore you. But there's, let's not forget, you're also ridiculously feisty. You, you keep me on my toes every single day. You make me proud to say that you're mine, and I don't think I could ask for a better wife. Even if I could, you'd kill me. <laughs> when I told Adam that I'd be wearing the kilt, he said, that sounds great, but what's the tartan? I was shocked, as I assumed that she would be wearing white and you can call her Mrs. Westwood. <laughs> I practically wouldn't see Adam if it wasn't for Sam, so thank you for arranging all the play dates. <laughs> it's much appreciated. <laughs> I just want to say congratulations and I'm really proud of Adam. <laughs> <laughs>